Good morning, you guys. Dexstar here, and welcome back to my channel. So I'm currently in the middle of basically just preparing myself to, I mean, to, to do our day today, and I hope that everybody's doing all right. So I've already done my base. We're just putting a bit of contour and doing a bit of color. So we don't really look as, I mean, for me, I would love to look as pale, but I don't want to look dead. <laughs> all right, so we're just putting a bit of color onto her face. Let me just finish all this and then we can get along with our day. Alright you guys, we are all set and ready and as you can see, I don't know if it's that obvious, hair done, our face done, <laughs> but I think I will just need to get a bit of a bit of a pick-me-up, maybe a coffee and a piece of bread or something just to um, go through our start of the day for now because I'm a bit tired of preparing food. So we'll get a bit of coffee, a bit of bread and then... Um, we'll start with talking about shoes. See you in a bit. Let's do breakfast first. All right, you guys. So this is how breakfast is today. You have a piece of omelet right here and that has like um, crab sticks in it. And then these are um, like seaweed pearls. And then of course, a bit of that sweet chili sauce. And you have my very trusted black coffee everyday iced black coffee. That really just is the one that perks me up. Let me show you how it looks inside. I don't know if it will actually show, but you see the crab sticks right there? I so love crab sticks, oh my gosh. Bon appetit. All right, you guys, we are here and ready, ready, ready to share with you guys my top five shoe styles that you will be needing in every spring and summer season. Now the colors and the colors and the brand doesn't really matter. It just depends on your personal preference or your personal style. And also uh, in terms of the brand, it depends on your budget as well and what is available to you. Also, one disclaimer, all of these shoes are personally bought by moi, okay? No sponsorship, well, oh my gosh, I will be very happy if any of these would be sponsored to me, but at the moment, not yet, all right? <laughs> but all of these are personally bought, and I do hope that you get a bit of an inspiration of how you will be able to get hold of different shoe styles and fit it according to your style, all right? Now, I would love to put this from somehow a bit more of a casual, like casual wear up into a bit more formal, if you may want that, but that let me do it according to that. Um, I don't think I will be able to link anything down below since all of these are, for me, basically a classic but they will really be a very good staple addition into your wardrobe if you get um, per a particular style, any particular style of these shoes. All right, so also in terms of pricing, I don't think I'll be able to remember any of these, but please do bear with me. <laughs> these shoes has been, a, has been with me for a while, but um, I hope I can share a bit of a, background of how, I don't know, of how I got them or where I got them or something, if I can remember. <laughs> Anyways, let me start, of course, with this. This has been a, um, 
I think up until now, this is still a uh, quite a trend, which is the chunky sneakers, if you may see that. Now, I particularly got this. This is from Steve Madden. I got this when uh, I went to the States, and it was, I think, on... I got this from an outlet store, basically. It was on sale from an outlet store, so why not? And I love this because of how classic it looks. Well, it, if you may see, you will really see that there. It's it really looks uh, snake skin. This is not real snake skin. This is just leather printed snake skin, and this uh, this part here is suede. And if you will see, it looks kind of loud. If you may see that, I mean, if you notice that, it looks kind of loud. But I feel like it's one that is a bit more classic because of the color like it's it's more of a neutral color and it can really fit into your wardrobe and i know that this is a bit more of a trendy piece but i think because it is a classic color it could last you a bit longer than when it's trending all right so this is one of my one of the top five pairs or styles at the moment, a chunky pair of sneakers. All right, okay. Now, next one, i put that back, okay. Next one is, of course, a regular white sneakers, but I don't really do white, white sneakers unless it's really necessary. So this one is a pair of regular white sneakers from Giorgio Armani. And it, what I really love about this is that it is in full leather. This particular sneakers is in full leather, except of course for this particular this part, which is the this part and the sole part, which is the rubber part or that material that they use. But the rest is in full leather, which I really love because your feet can really breathe somehow. <laughs> All right, so this is one of where you can, I mean, majority, for sure, if you're in spring and summer, majority of things that you will wear is either a linen pair of shorts or a linen pair of trousers. And this will be good to be paired with a linen shorts and a tank top or a casual shirt. So, and because of the color and it's white and this is in uh, navy blue, that would actually be a perfect color. Another classic color as well that you can actually add into your wardrobe for a very classic and functional functional feel as well. All right, so this is one of, of course, a very good staple into your wardrobe, a pair of white sneakers. I just wanted to have a bit more of color so it doesn't really look like very boring. <laughs> okay, so that is um, a pair of white sneakers from Giorgio Armani. Another staple, and with this, actually, I have tried to, with this particular pair of shoes, I really uh, splurged. <laughs> this is a pair of Hermes canvas sneakers. And again, with the color, if you will see, it's blue, it's white, it's very classic. And just a hint of that Hermes orange color um, down the heel and it's very nice. It's really very classic if you may see This has been this. I mean this has been worn like a whole lot of times. This has been with me for uh, What do you call that? This has been with me for wherever I went So this is one of my staples as well during spring summer a canvas sneakers that it, I mean this is very comfortable very comfortable and I really really love wearing them so this is one of those staples that you really can't go wrong you might splurge a bit but it's gonna last you quite a while and if you may see because these are leather um, leather pieces it's been quite difficult to clean them but it's really still worth it's really still worth the purchase I guess <laughs> So there you go guys, a pair of canvas sneakers from Hermes, which is, oh my gosh, I really love them, I really, really love them. When I really saw them, I said, I'm really gonna get them. <sighs> well, I got them at a very good price, so 
That's why it's it's one big staple, and it's re it really since then it has been worn to death. <laughs> All right, next stop is actually a uh, more like a casual, semi-formal um, pair of shoes, and these are you may call them driver shoes or boat shoes, but I think these are called driver shoes. And these are our loafers. These are loafers from Ferragamo. And this, this brand has actually started my, was that really a quest? Or this brand has really started my um, thing, if you may want to call it. <laughs> my thing of really having good quality, good quality pair of shoes and well, previously I have already been into shoes, but more into, um, a bit more into the high street brands. But with, when I started with Ferragamo, I think this pair of shoes or this brand has started my obsession with not really collecting, but having that quality pair of shoes. So this is one that's in camel color and you have the Fer Fer Ferragamo buckle. And what I, what I like about this is the sole wherein you have it in a like more of a dark green, bottle green color of the sole here. And you can still see the camel color in between. But this is one staple that I usually, I really, really, uh, I really, really love during spring, summer because it's very comfortable to walk in as well. And because it's very comfortable and I love them, I got them in a different color, still the same loafers. It's just that in different color and both of them are in suede, which is, um, if you may, if other people would say it's gonna be a little bit more difficult to maintain, but if you really know, if you would maintain them properly, it would really last you a very, very long time. And all of these are in genuine suede leather. All right, so you have a different buckle here of Ferragamo and this is really one big staple as well. Loafers shoes are really a very big, good staple during spring, summer, because aside from the comfort that it gets, if you have these kind of style, it can really last you from morning to night. All right, and last but not the least, of course, is one for those who are going to the office. This is a more of your formal leather shoes, and this is from Hugo Boss. And I, I actually got this mustardy color because I know that it's gonna, it's gonna spark a bit of a difference in your outfit. And it really will be a very good addition to your wardrobe, basically because during spring, summer, it's where you have all the light colors and you have all the happy colors. And well, this can be, this can be worn during winter. It's just that um, this will be a bit more suitable in summer. However, this can be, this can be a very good, uh, what do you call that? Very good color and tr uh, not really a trend, but a very good style when you are actually in the office, like for an office wear. And this is one of those staple shoes that you will never go wrong with. It really just depends on the color that you want or if you are really into a bit more of a um, pop of color into your style then this will be a very good addition to your suiting wardrobe. All right, all right. All right, you guys. So basically those are my five, like my top five shoes in terms of a spring summer, um, spring summer wear. So you would have maybe one trendy piece, which is what I have there, like a chunky sneakers, and then another with a canvas, um, canvas sneakers and then your regular white sneakers which is really going to be a very good staple and then loafers which brings you from day to night and it's really a bit more flexible and with your comfort as well and also with a with those people who are going to the office and are who are really required to wear um, a pair of suit these ones will be a very good addition adding a pop of color would be so much, uh, so much better, and that would also bring your whole outfit to life. All right. <laughs> also, you guys, depending on, as I've said earlier, 
I don't know if I've said it, not, or whatever. <laughs> but depending on your budget, the brand doesn't really matter on where you get them as long as you are comfortable with them and you feel happy with your purchase, then that will be one that will be suited for you, all right? So uh, look at, for me, I would really look at the functionality, functionality and also the quality. Because sometimes you would really think of getting, um, yeah, I got this because it's a bit more affordable, but then again, um, moving forward in the long term, would that still be, are you a kind of person who really looks for um, quality or is it quantity, okay? Because if you really just want like a pair of shoes would last you for a year or two, then go ahead and go for the more affordable ones. But um, if you're into the quality and having shoes that would really last you for quite a while, then I think um, it will be better to splurge a bit or spend a little bit more knowing that you will get the how I mean how a lot of people will call it like the cost per wear knowing that you will get the cost per wear of the item that you actually got would be a bit more um, satisfying to you as a customer and also for me since I am more of that fashion enthusiast <laughs> Um, I would actually venture into more of, aside from having a staple pair of shoes, more of that, not really a head turning pair of shoes, but something that's really going to be a very good addition to my wardrobe. All right, so I do hope that you were able to get um, inspiration into getting your spring summer pair of shoes and having that kind of mentality that it will be better to really get a quality one rather than having a whole lot of different pair of shoes. Okay? <laughs> All right, you guys. And of course, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to click on the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Also, don't forget to share, share, share. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Till the next one, have a lovely, lovely day. Bye!